I'm KP Shashi. I'm a filmmaker. I made around 30 films, around uh, 26 or 27 documentaries and three feature films and two music videos. And uh, uh, I'm known as a filmmaker. Uh, earlier I was known as a cartoonist. I was a cartoonist. I do cartoons for uh, activist groups once in a while. Uh, I do a bit of writing. And uh, but primarily I'm an activist. I started off as an activist as a young days. I still believe that I'm an activist first than a filmmaker or uh, 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 or I do music also. Uh, any, anything like that. You know, these are all extra. But uh, whatever I do has something to do with activism somewhere. Every film I made had something to do with activism somewhere. Uh, I've uh, traveled with so many people's movements in this country and uh, uh, where people's movements are not there. I've, uh, on social issues I worked on when uh, people's movements were not there on nuclear energy, I worked on uh, uh, nuclear energy. Uh, I made the first anti-nuclear energy film in 1986. I made the first uh, anti, anti large dam film uh, on Narmada. I made the first uh, anti uh, uh, hazardous drugs, pharmaceutical drugs campaign film called In the Name of Medicine. Maybe in the feature film uh, world, it is the first film of its kind uh, on uh, violence on women and uh, uh, social and psychological women, uh, violence on women called Elaine Mullum. Uh, that was made in 1993. Uh, uh, exploring various dimensions of uh, uh, social and psychological violence on women. So that way there were a lot of uh, 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 first kind of thing in my life. Uh, many films which are first. Uh, and then a lot of, uh, maybe the first uh, 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 struggle of Fisher people in this country, uh, the film was made in 1984. At that time video was also not uh, very popular. Uh, in Kerala also it was very not popular. The first film on people science movement I made, you know. At that time uh, video was not uh, popular at all, actually. Then others, so many others made films. Uh, I made the first film on Narmada, but uh, several others uh, made uh, and some of them made brilliant films and I, may, I have a lot of respect for them. They, they, the way they uh, saw the issues, you know, also like Anand Patwal and uh, Kasmi and Ali Kasmi and uh, even uh, our, uh, uh, several others. Okay, you know. So. Uh, but I have the advantage of uh, looking into issues to a certain extent uh, first. Maybe that may be my plus point in many issues and uh, involving others. And uh, Madani was also uh, when people were not uh, speaking out. Uh, he was in Bangalore and in Bangalore I was the first to respond. So. Uh, it is not as, as a filmmaker, it is an activist I responded. Uh, so, uh, uh, so I'm the first. <laughs> but but uh, actually, uh, it doesn't matter who is the first. Who does, uh, who, uh, does maximum and sustains is most important. You know, quite often I cannot sustain because of many reasons. It doesn't matter. Who is the first in many many of these activist issues? You know. Who sustains and who connects maximum is the most important thing. Quite often I have to drop out because of many factors, you know. But uh, in the filmmaking, I have uh, many things uh, I did first. This uh, you were saying there were around 50, more than 50 documentaries you made. Movies. No, no, no. Uh, uh, let me remember, it's actually around uh, 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 27 documentaries, 3 feature films and uh, 2 
म्यूजिक वीडियोस व्हाट आर द जॉनरस यू सेड मेडिसिन एनी नर्मदा व्हाट आर द जॉनरस इफ यू हैव टू गैदर इन इंडिया इफ यू टेक एससी एसटी ओबीसी माइनॉरिटी थ्री फोर ग्रुप्स ऑफ देम सो दैट लार्जली दिस जॉनर वेरी इट फिक्स ऑल ओवर ऑन सोशल इश्यूज एंड सोशल मूवमेंट्स एज सच बट आउट ऑफ 27 डॉक्यूमेंट्रीज आई डोंट शो many documentaries at all altogether i will i am right now i am promoting only 21 doc, uh, films including uh, feature films and uh, uh, documentaries many documentaries uh, i put it on the dustbin because uh, when you make a documentary it, it's it, it's a got a historical specificity and uh, the movement changes its character the leaders change you know when the leaders change movement changes you know like individuals can change you know individuals groups and people's movements can change its character you know so uh, uh, i i i i uh, uh, put uh, several of my at that time it was relevant okay then later i found in the movement and the situation historical situation change Uh, because of that i put uh, my some of my documentaries in, my, in the dustbin and uh, even if people demand it i won't give it because the historical situation has changed and the movement has changed or the individuals have changed all that you know so that one thing is also i and i know sorry i to uh, uh, answer the question uh, uh, i would call itself uh, my genre of film as third cinema you know you have a uh, commercial films you have uh, art films uh the major filmmaking and documentaries is commercial film cinema you know they make money out of uh, documentaries that's what that's why they make documentaries uh the the biggest uh, documentary film uh, producers in this country are the corporate world and the state in the state you know then there are something called independent cinema i am not an independent filmmaker you know i am very dependent filmmaker you know i i depend on people's movements i depend upon activists i depend upon alternative information uh, intellectuals who work on uh, those information uh, i depend upon so many people for help you know my own team you know i depend for people for my support financial support also you know? so i can't make a film without dependence you know and uh, uh, the point is uh, uh, my role uh, as a filmmaker is to be part of a social process it is like a chain you know uh, i can do certain things like a chain uh, you know thing. then somebody else can do something like that is you know uh, like that it goes you know? and we can inspire each other some some journalists can uh, help out in inspiring in a different way you know sometimes uh, certain journalists uh, inspire me sometimes i inspire certain journalists you know sometimes certain uh, researchers inspire me sometimes i inspire certain researchers you know sometimes certain movements uh, activists uh, inspire me sometimes i inspire certain activists so it's like a chain we are a uh, chain club okay uh, adding to the since you have been answering this so that you said around 30 documentaries you have made around mm-hmm. so that and you also said that it's not commercial if that is the case why don't you upload it in public website is it available all the documentaries some uh, some of them are available mm-hmm. uh, in the uh, thing there's a you can see in the youtube uh, uh, music video called america america mm-hmm. uh, uh, that film was shown uh, it's a 5 5 minutes uh, music video which we made after the iraq war of uh, american invasions and uh, it was used almost uh, almost in every country in the world uh, in web- one website uh, i saw that uh, at least 6 months back i saw that there were 97 lakh people had seen it you know uh, i thought if they had given me 1 rupee i would have been uh, karodpati by now <laughs> okay uh, <laughs> now another uh, another music video called gaav chhod ab nahi Yeah. is also available it's on the adivasi uh, struggles Str- against the spectrum because yours uh, i i uh, everything i had the involvement okay uh, i i made the music video mm-hmm. 
but but right from script stage i had some involvement in everything you know but uh, the point is and some others other films also there is something called uh, fish people struggle called resisting um, coastal invasion is available on the net you know not all because we are also selling uh, we want to generate some money out of selling also uh, we are not successful but we are trying and uh, that's uh, the thing but then uh, I, let me come back to your earlier question which i have not answered properly the genre you know the point is that uh, uh, so far uh, there was some commercial films and not films and all that but i would say for the last three decades when i started activist films when i started activist films there were only two activist film makers in this country actually you know? uh now you can uh, i don't know whether you can call it activist films uh, uh, or alternative films for some time i call it alternative films um uh, there are various names which you can use uh, for this kind of films on uh, socially concerned uh, films or uh, fil- uh, issue based films or many names you can use you know but uh, it's actually a third cinema what those two Huh? Who are those two? You were saying. Ah, uh, when I when I started, uh, there were only Anand Patpan, uh, Anand Patpan and uh, Tapan Bose. Okay. And both of them inspired me. You know, the first p- films of uh, first film of Tapan Bose. It was on a Dalit issue, where in Bagarpur, uh, around seven uh, Dalits uh, were blinded by the police in Bagarpur. They th- they poured acid into their eyes, and on this human rights issue. Uh, uh they were in uh, the station lock up and uh, when uh, uh, they cried for uh, water the police uh, bagalpur police uh, urinated into their mouth they couldn't see also you know they asked for water only and uh, their interviews were there after they came out of jail you know and their eyes were all deep all gone with acid so uh, it, it, uh i don't know whether it's available on the net it is called an indian story an indian story ah and that tapan bos tapan bos yeah and uh, uh, I, uh my blood really rose at that time i was working as a cartoonist in free press journal and uh, same time uh, just before that I, i when i was working in free press journal i saw uh uh Anand Patmudan's uh, Prisoners of Conscience. Uh, that is on political prisoners during emergency. So uh, I, I was also uh, coming from the same period, you know, uh, of emergency. If, if emergency was not there, I would not have been an activist. Uh, so I, I was coming from the 70s generation. Uh, uh, so I was also a, a film lover. right from my childhood i saw a lot of commercial films later a lot of art films but this was the a third cinema which i saw you know these two films it was very close to my politics so uh, um, i uh, didn't go back to cartoons after that oh, you uh, forgot cartoons i forgot cartoons and then started making films so this film chengara struggle was happening There were a lot of Adivasi struggles and Dalit struggles also happening in Kerala. Uh, did, did, was there any documentary film which you made on that? There were several uh, documentaries. Uh, one of the main uh, resources was my friend uh, Sharad Chandran. He was a very close friend of mine. He was my age. He died a few years back. Uh, but uh, we started almost together. In fact, he started uh, a video in, uh, as a Malayali, the first video person on documentaries. He's the first person, but an activist uh, filmmaker, I may be the first person. And we started together almost. And every film that he made, I had some role to it. In every film I made, he had some role to it. You know, we are always discussing uh, together on many issues over phone. On, on many issues, we are together. On Chengara, he made a, uh, a documentary. you were also uh, part of it or uh, i i i did the music for that you know in computer i made the music for that you know and this i would discuss also on the uh, film so i was involved from behind uh, but he was involved in behind for many films that i made 
so in every film uh, he he will give me acknowledgement in every film i will give him acknowledgement so that kind of equation was there between us okay you are from coming from kerala society and on adivasi he made also did something on mutanga mutanga uh, anyway. uh, you were also part of it mutanga ah helping out in different uh, that's uh, you know uh, it's like uh, minimum help mm-hmm. it's all minimum help okay. so that uh, you come from kerala society could you speak about kerala society how it is because it's called mm-hmm. gods of devils of own country like that could you speak about it how the caste system is there Uh, uh, I, I would uh, need a little bit of time to explain on this. Can I use the time? Yeah, you can uh, yeah, use it. How much time should I use? Yeah, 